Hey girl, she's scrolling. Hey guys, this is Priscilla. This is Sunny. Sunny, what are you doing? Uh, I, w I was messaging my friend. Messaging your friend yes. without talking to me? Wow, what are you doing? I doing my thing, playing games. I just download Arena of Valor and it's so fun. We are coming here not for the phone, it's for the filming. I know, but we should definitely talk about it. What Sunny and I just did, you must have come across this in daily life. Yes, when I was hanging out with my friends and family, I usually just play with my phone. Yeah, and if we say that in Chinese, Playing with your phone, that would be one show ji. Yes, one means to play, show ji means mobile. Show it means hand. Ji means machine. So together, show ji means mobile. To say it in a sentence, we say Wo xi huan wan shou ji. I like to play my phone. Right, and playing with your phone is very, you know, like very general. Can be anything, like chatting with a friend, playing games. If we want to be very specific, like saying playing games, that would be one yu xi. One is a verb saying to play. Yu xi is the game. So if we form a sentence, I love playing games, that would be wo ai wan yu xi. Here's a recap of what the phrases what we have just learned. 我喜欢玩手机 But sometimes the phone I feel like they separate people from each other and like they it used to be a very good tool to connect you and your friends who is like over abroad or uh, far away from you. But right now even you are just sitting to each other you don't talk. Yes, and actually it's bad for your health if you put your head down all the time. Yeah, like your backbone is hurting all the time. Yeah, and we have a very interesting slang for that or like the word for that that is smartphone zombie, <laughs> shorter, uh, smombie. Oh, smombie, okay. We also have this in Chinese, we call di tou zu. Di tou means head down. Zu means some kind of people. So di tou zu means people who are always with their head down, doing something. Can be looking at the computer, uh, or phones, or book. So uh, we also have like people who usually go to work that we call them 上班族 Yes, 上班族 Zu is the same as yes. 低头族 yes. 上班 just like an adjective yes. before 族 Yes So 我们是上班族 不要做低头族 So we have a sentence that can combine everything together in Chinese in one sentence, right? Yes, that is 很多人都是低头族因为他们喜欢玩手机和玩游戏 Actually, this video is our new channel, educational channel so we are sharing you guys with several very interesting phenomena around us and at the same time, we are also teach you several useful Chinese words or phrases. Okay, hope you guys will like it.